मार्जी और पीसीसी प्रेसिडेंट और बैजू जी और देवेंद्र ऑल द नागालैंड पीसीसी लीडर्स ऑल द ऑफिस बेरेस फ्रंटर्स डिस्ट्रिक्ट्स पेंडू गोपाल जी इज बीन ट्रैवलिंग टू द नॉर्थ ईस्ट it travel yesterday was in manipur planning for the launching of the yatra and then he traveled all the way to nagaland to meet it so basically this it is to understand all the issues connected with yatra today in nagaland and he have raised some of the uh, issues the yatra is so seriously that he has come and that itself signifies how important this yatra is going to be it is just not in nagaland but when it enters nagaland the message will be all over india cool. and the way uh, you have been preparing your pcc has been preparing as although nagaland pcc is preparing it the yatra is of people to review the preparations of bharat jodo nyay yatra which is going to we happen in nagaland from 15 night onwards bharat jodo yatra we had conducted earlier from kanyakumari to kashmir rahul gandhi walked 4500 kilometers to spread love message affectionate message throughout this country just now i told about the slogan नफरत के बाजार में मोहब्बत का दुखा दैट वॉज द स्लोगन वॉज टेकन बाय एंटेयर पीपल ऑफ दिस कंट्री दैट यात्रा वॉज अ हिस्टोरिक वन एंड ग्रैंड सक्सेस इन इंडियन पोलिटिकल सीनरी नाउ राहुल गांधी स्टार्टिंग ए यात्रा नेम्ड एज भारत जोड़ो न्याय यात्रा which is going to be inaugurated by honorable congress president mallikarjuna karge on 14th at imphal manipur this yatra objective is to seek justice for youth of this country you are all know that the most disappointed section of this country society is the youth nowadays why they are not getting any jobs unemployment rate is the on high record on the union government is not paying attention for fulfilling the aspirations of the youth of this country the were youth is totally disappointed due to unemployment the were youth should get justice on these things we are seeking justice for the youth of this country same way women are very much harassing they are not getting their livelihood price rises are increasing everywhere government is not even consider the women sentiments so we are seeking justice for women the poor rich gap is widening every day the entire government is only concentrating on making one or two people extra rich they are totally neglecting the poor people of this country the way in which manrega had been improved introduced by the upa government you people know that but nice government is trying to dilute that manrega lot many issues are there therefore we are seeking justice for poor people we are seeking justice for uh, farmers Now this is basically this yatra is to highlight the people's sentiments, their issues, their sorrows through a big platform. Certainly, I think Nagaland also our youth are very much disappointed <coughs> due to unemployment. We have to take up the issues specific specifically in Nagaland. We are this is not a political yatra. I am telling you, this is not a political yatra. We are taking up the issues of the common people. definitely we are inviting all other like minded people intellectuals civil society people to join this yatra i am requesting you nagaland media people also 
give maximum coverage for this yatra. This type of ethnic issue, we have a clear-cut idea. We have a clear-cut line. We, every time we used to stand with Nagaland, the sentiment of the people of Nagaland. This is Congress party was very much nourished thus when during the Indiraji's time, in, including Pandiji's name also. So we are for Nagaland people. No, we, we will, that during the Yatra, you will get a clear-cut idea about all these things. The, our basic principle is we never promote anything against Naga people or Nagaland community. No, this Yatra is going to be a historic one. I think we are, we, we are witnessing a lot of enthusiasm among the party workers and among the public about this Yatra. Of course, this Yatra is not at all a political Yatra. This is not any connection with the elections and parliament election, but being a party lead, uh, worker, I have a great expectation about the Nagaland Parliament seat. Last election also, we fought very well in Parliament. It was a close fight. This election, let Nagaland, Naga people decide that thing. I, but I, we have a hope on that. Okay, thank you. Nagaland TV, Sop Manulaga Awas. Watch us live on Geo TV and on your television sets as well. For Dumapu viewers, we are on channel number 994 in Global Chapter. And Kohima and Mokokchong viewers, switch to channel number 138 on Hornbill Digital. For all news and updates, follow us on Facebook, Instagram, YouTube, and Twitter.